tonight, London lights up for the greatest sporting show on earth. Standing tall, Lauren Jackson leads our Aussie stars onto the Olympic stage. Our rowers recreate their own curtain raiser. And top to toe in green and gold, Australians unite in the spirit of the Games. As the London cauldron lit up, so too did Sydney's old flame. At Platinum Preschool in Randwick, they had their own torch relay. They love sports, even if they're not technically Olympic ones. Well, I like <laughs> ball climbing. They're pretty good cyclists, though, and they're high jumpers. Yay! At the Sandhurst Golf Club in Melbourne, they paraded too, with flames and a cauldron. Like Warmth that would have been welcome at Federation Square. But the show didn't disappoint. It's amazing. It's really cool. And the peacemakers of the world bringing the flag in. And the passing of the torch to the next generation. Fantastic. I liked when Mr B threw his tissue on the piano. Everyone's very bright-eyed this morning, but remember this is only day one of a full two-week stretch of early mornings and late nights full of Olympic action. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie! I think we might be hearing a few more of them too. This guy certainly will. He's in a 17-day lockdown as part of an Olympics viewing radio stunt. Ellie Southwood, 10 News.